for over three decades, Hospice Northwest has been helping those in our community facing a life-limiting illness along with uh, grief and bereavement support, community services, caregiver support. They do a lot for folks in our community and they need your help. My guest this evening is Melissa Hazen, the uh, volunteer coordinator for Hospice Northwest. Uh, the list of things that you folks do with your volunteers in the community is just amazing. Oh, thank you, Fiona. We're very lucky and blessed to have such a wonderful group of volunteers who help us to provide all of our programming free of charge. Now, the downside of uh, what is going on right now is although your volunteers are working very hard, uh, you don't have enough people to cover the need. There is a wait list for your programs. So I understand you are looking for just a few more volunteers. <laughs> yes, it has definitely been a difficult uh, couple of years and our volunteers have worked tirelessly. Uh, that being said, we do have a great demand. So it's my hope this, this volunteer campaign to recruit 40 new volunteers for our city and also for our region. Now, you are looking for a broad spectrum of volunteers. You really want to make sure you can support everyone. So what kind of variety are you looking for in the people who step up? Oh, we're grateful for all applicants, but definitely are encouraging um, diversity in this campaign. Um, we're hoping to be able to provide service in all of the languages of our community, and we're open to any demographic, male or female, but especially hoping to attract applicants uh, of Indigenous peoples who can then in turn support other Indigenous peoples through their end of life and grief journeys in a very culturally specific way. Now this is not a huge time commitment. We're talking a couple of hours a week can b make a huge difference in someone's life and there's also a lot of uh, training involved uh, so you're not jumping in completely blind. Just before we go uh, a quick clarification there's an application and interview involved. Yes, so applications can be found on our website, hospicenorthwest.ca. Mm -hmm. That'll get you in touch with me. Um, at that time, we'll schedule a screening interview. Then you'll provide your vulnerable sectors police records check, and then we're off to the races from there. All right, so if you think you can help somebody uh, dealing with a life-limiting illness, contact Hospice Northwest today. Thank you so much, Melissa. Thank you, Fiona. Around Town has been brought to you by Adult and Teen Challenge Super Thrift. Call 345-2277.